Okay, no time for intros right now. This is looking ridiculous. Look at this, ladies and gents. Ravencoin, one of the biggest pumpers today. We can see we're up 20%, and we are trying to break out of this crazy, crazy ascending triangle. And to be honest, we are already on the brink of breaking out. We came through this resistance at 0 0.043. I think Ravencoin might even see continuation up to these moon boy levels over at 0 0.075. It's hard to predict the future, of course, but when you're breaking out of such a bullish continuation pattern, it's the only thing you can wonder. Now, looking at the Bollinger Bands, we can see... Ravencoin is sitting right at the top and we are very overextended of the 20 day moving average so it typically it's quite a bearish sign but the bulls are certainly in control right now for our friend Ravencoin we've perfectly been bouncing off the support trend line here multiple multiple times so it has served as a very very key entry point here for Ravencoin so we're speculating are we going to get a bounce further onwards for our time frame we are looking overbought on the rsi but we have continuously been putting through some high highs as well as lower lows and this was the huge breakout here at 0.036 Printing another candle at the moment on the four hour time frame. I'd love to see where this finishes. One hour, it looks like we've retested this as a nice healthy support at 0 0.043. So it's possible we do get continuation to the upside here, guys. We're gonna go into a smaller time frame. Do bear with me. Um, so yeah, still putting through higher lows, but we're getting slightly lower highs. So we might be on the verge of forming a bit of a, a horizontal channel or a symmetrical triangle. I haven't really looked at the, the pattern just yet, but it does look fairly bullish actually is it a bit of an ascending triangle or an ascending channel i'd say more of a triangle because the lines are converging so let's see what can happen here this could be absolutely crazy if we get a breakout from this particular level the volume that's been coming through is tremendous at the moment on the 15 minute time frame as well as the four hour getting loads of volume which is really really good reflecting that there is a significant amount of traction right now for ravencoin i have no idea why ravencoin is doing what it's doing but we should definitely know that we have a very, very bullish pattern right here. And if we do see continuation to the upside, it is very, very possible to see the higher resistance levels like 0 0.076 targeted. When we look at the weekly time frame, you know, looking back, retrospectively speaking, we're still extremely undervalued. Um, and in my opinion, I do think it's possible that we might get a pump. I think my, my client's going to crash on me. Sorry, guys, it's frozen. I don't know what's going up. Uh, let me... No, we don't have to refresh. Can't handle the pump of Ravencoin right now, but we can see, of course, we're trying to break out. So if we were to measure some of these resistance trend lines, um, there's a lot of empty space, isn't there, around here. We haven't really came up to these euphoric levels for a while, but the fact we are breaking through here is really, really important. Um, do we have a 200-week moving average? No. 20-day moving average, we're a bit overextended, so we have broken back through, which could mean it's the inception of a new uptrend here for Ravencoin. We've got a long, long way to go, remember, guys. Um, let's not get too bullish too soon, but from this bottom, I mean, if you did buy over here in June, you're up 160%, which is already incredible gains. I would consider taking some profits off the plate if you got in that early. Um, this was the oversold position on the weekly RSI, and we are still down a massive amount, remember, from the top. So we're still down 84% in terms of Ravencoin's performance. So keep a little eye out on Ravencoin. I don't know why it's pumping. There's got to be some crazy reasons as to why. Let's have a look at the volume here. We can see coin market cap, 467 million market cap, rank 80, loads of volume coming through. Um, looking at the markets, all the volume is pretty much on Binance. You know, it's, everything's on Binance, isn't it? It's just an absolute crypto whore, Binance. It just loves to dominate the market and it probably always will. Um, but yeah, I really, really like what I'm seeing here for Raven Crypto Bubbles. We can see Raven is up stealing the show today, um, even more so than Terra Luna Classic. Let's quickly look at the old Raven coin, shall we? See what's going on. Uh, do we have any insightful news here? You know, da -da -da -da. I can't see any reason as to why. Raven surges 26% in less than two days. Are there partnerships? Maybe there's some partnership in the background or some big investors. I'd really have to look at the on-chain analytics to understand what's going on with Ravencoin right now. But guys, if you are bullish on Ravencoin, subscribe to the channel. And I'd love it if you could hop into the Discord whilst the community is super, super active. We're all getting excited about different things, crypto. So come say hello down in the Discord channel just below. And yeah, come say hi, don't be shy. If you're new here as well, Make sure you slap that subscribe button, like, comment, you lovely people, you, you know you want to, go on, 
do it just hit that subscribe make someone's day because this youtube gig is not easy anyway bye bye